Hey guys, today me and Andrew are gonna be trying five different meat sticks from Hunter's Reserve. These were at Bed Bath & Beyond, so they, you know they're gonna be a little pricier. Uh, they were $2.49 a piece each. Um, they had one more Ooh, that was, bitty. they had elk, but they were out of it. So I have pheasant with pork, duck with pork. This is wild boar, meat from feral swine, and pork with honey. So it's gonna be a sweet one. This is meat stock smoked bison with pork. They're all with pork. And this is the meat stock smoked bison with pork and chipotle. It's a uh, spicy, it's spicy flame warning. So that'll be last because we don't want to. And then the bison next to it. Uh, there's no way I can read the calories, so I don't have to read it. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> you can open it too. Crack in the pheasant, gluten free. It says nitrates, MSG, grams of protein, eight calories. grams of protein. Uh, Seventy for the entire stick. Oh, that's not bad at all. And this is the pheasant, so you can just Seventy for the pheasant. So we'll probably just wind up killing these, won't we? Yeah, you look. I, I hate how it's like perforated eight times. So you, you have a you have a better like opening than that. Yeah. yeah, but look, it's oh, damn, it. I can't grab. Oh yeah, they really uh, they they like. Put nicks in it like somebody went to town with a home. Oh, dear Lord. <laughs> ha ha! Look at the fat. You see those? You know what? There you go. The label is a good place to go for. All right, so tore right off. Look, it actually mushy. It is. It's a little mushy. Pheasant. No, as mushy as I thought that was going to be. It's not firmer when you're eating it. You feel like you're eating a pheasant. You know what pheasant tastes like? No, oh, yeah. I really, it's just like a regular old. Mm -hmm. It's got some spice to it. It does have some good spiciness. No, I mean, that's good. I like it. I like the texture. I think their, their um, skins are a little tougher. The, the skin on the outside. Um, the casing, I think the casing is a little tough, uh, but I think it's good. You know, we have four more of these, dude. I don't care. I wanted to, I got the tiny, I, I tore this tiny little piece Take off. a big bite of it. And you, I ate a big hunk of it. Bit half the stick. <laughs> I think it's good. I like that. It's got a good spice to it. I really do like There's it. not much for your 250. No, you don't get a lot, but this is really good. That's really good. Mm -hmm. Really, really good. I don't know that it tastes any different than any other meat stick out there, but that one, the that pheasant one, part, but that one, I mean, I'm, I still got the spices. Mm -hmm. That's good. So this one's the duck. This one's the duck. And it wasn't really mushy or it wasn't really fatty or anything like that. So mm. uh -huh. I've had quail. I've never had pheasant. I've I've had, the same thing. I've had squirrel. I've had rabbit and quail. We used yeah. to be a restaurant in Lexington. Have had squirrel? I've had squirrel. I had roadkill squirrel. Calamari. I had roadkill squirrel with the person that killed it, picked it up after they ran over it and put it in the truck. Man, you know, <laughs> if I could rub a lamp right now, I'd wish for a knife. Like a, like a just, paring knife? Just, just sit there and... No, that's, that's, that's not a knife magic, Jenny. That's a pair of scissors. Oh, wow. I got that one though, but I'm using this for the next one because that was hell. Trying to get that little package open. Actually, I think I took half the stick. And you left me in the hole that you couldn't open. <laughs> Ooh. Guys, this is an exotic little flavor. Okay, now you got me intrigued. He's not getting the experience. It's like a teriyaki, but it's unique. Something dirty about it. Huh? <laughs> the face tells you everything. The casing softer, mm -hmm. so I like that. There's a little bit of funkiness there. There's a little funkiness. I kind of like it. It's not bad. Ain't nothing wrong with a little funk. I don't think I'd want to eat that. <laughs> it's kind of like I like the pheasant. It's kind of like, like that. you could like if I was blindfolded, I think I could have told you that was a duck. I would have probably guessed it was a duck because you you pulled that right out of the pond. Yeah, I, I don't like that. One. That one's funky. That one is a little funky. I don't, I like it, but I don't. But it does have a teriyaki kind of feel to it. It does kind of have a sweet feel to it. But it doesn't say, I mean, just. No, just pour it. All right, so now we're going to wild bore it. How many calories is it? Uh, 60. Did I even say it for the duck? Duck is 70. Okay, so I didn't say it. I gotta get a drink after that duck because that's uh, funky. That's, that's, I would say nasty, but it's not nasty. It's just, just different. 
Your knives are not sharp. No, that knife stinks. I almost cut my finger off. You couldn't cut your finger off if you like saw at your finger with that knife, I don't think. That, I cut the actual meat stick with it. <laughs> ha ha. But, do you want me to try to twist it? Pull my meat stick. <laughs> Alright. I actually had to grab that one. That one's tougher. So this is the wild boar with the honey. And it's feral swine, so you don't know what's gonna happen here. Gonna go crazy. Ah! <laughs> um, I like that one. That one's good. That one has a good flavor to it. Um, I still like the pheasant better because it had a little spice to it. That one's got more of a sweet flavor. Yeah, yeah, it's not bad. I think that one's very nothing. It's kind of bland. It's very bland, very, very plain. Um, I like the duck better than that. Yeah, no, the duck. The duck actually had some. It did have some flavor. It had some flavor. I do have. It come at you. That's this true. is just kind of. Eh. It's true. It's true. It's a, it's a it's a it's a tamer flavor. That's this for sure. This is not smoky and delicious. Bison. Yeah, I hope the bison's good. Ha! Yeah, it's got a good point to it. It's just to have a good blade to it. Well, it's bent. Yeah. I swear, I just cut right down next to it, and it didn't get the stick. <laughs> what? You did. That's oh, funny. look. Hang on. Here I am. There we go. Ha! There you go. All right, bison. Here we go. That tastes like a powerful creature. Hmm. Does it not? Doesn't it have a little bit of barbecue to it. It does have a little barbecue. Just a little bit of. I tell you what's missing though. I like the meaty, the meat flavor, gamey flavor. No, I like that part of it. I don't. I don't have any spice to it. It's more of a sweet. One. It is. It is sweet. Well, this is going to be your spice. I know. Hopefully, hopefully this will bring it to you. Um, but so far, I do I'm agree still, with you. I'm still a pheasant fan. Honestly, I like the funky duck. <laughs> funky duck. That'd be a good pub name. <laughs> funky, <The> funky duck. duck. <laughs> Hey, somebody, somebody make it happen. I want to the go. bison, it's okay. This is a dark. It is a dark. This is a dark meat stick. I wonder if it actually says on here anywhere. Give me just a second here. Uh, oh, no nitrates. That's what it says. I think I said it. Says, it has chipotle in it, which that's a smokier right. kind of spice. I'm just trying to, chipotle, I think that it's, I wanted to see what chili peppers, of course. Uh, I wanted to see if it had any kind of the other peppers. Oh, probably less, 80. Nope, more. All right, let's try to get into the package there. Oh, come on. I get one little hole out of that. <laughs> there we go. Still easier than trying to. Yeah, that's what I do. I'll cut my tape. I'm not on it. I think I might have actually. There you go. Not that this table hasn't seen its fair share. <laughs> oh, yeah. Again, a little tough. This one's very tough. Tougher than the rest you saw, I had to cut it. I couldn't do the twist. I could have, but I wouldn't want to fondle the stick too much there. That's sweet too. It does have a little smokiness though. But it's really, it's still sweet. Do you think the pork that they're adding to it is ruining it? I don't know. I know that's to save on cost, probably not having to. Oh yeah, you whole. can't hold, do a whole duck. Um, whatever. But most of them are, have beef, not we, pork. We each had a good sizable portion. Oh yeah. We're done. There's no spice, right? No, the only one that had any kind of spice was the pheasant. The spice, the pheasant was the only one. Yeah. Um, um and that it says hot, but it wasn't spicy at all. Spending really. more money is not always better. No. Now the pheasant, I do have to agree. I think the pheasant. I, and I don't know if it's worth 250 but I think the pheasant was definitely worth buying. Funky duck. And you like the duck. It's just weird. Yeah, it's it is It's the most unique strange. stick out of everyone here. You want something unique? You want the funky duck? Eat the funky duck. Yeah. Rename it the funky duck. <laughs> the rest of them were and just... people will buy it. Oh, this is called funky duck. We gotta try that, Tabitha, don't we? The rest Bam. of them were just boring. Really, weren't they? I'm gonna cut that. <laughs> the wild boar and the buffalo, yeah. I mean the bison. This one just... wasn't as sweet as I thought it would be. It was actually very generic. Yeah. And then the buffalo, I mean it 
there wasn't that much spice to it at all. Somebody brought me sticks from, I think, Gatlinburg or somewhere. Yeah. And they were gator and kangaroo, and they were really good. Yeah. <laughs> when do you get hooked on them? They, I think on, they're just on your way. They're they're mixed with beef too, though. <laughs> so. I think I would skip on these, for, especially for the price. Um, if you got them for maybe a dollar fifty, maybe. Try the duck. <laughs> try the duck. So if you see them in a Bed Bath and Beyond, Andrew says try the duck because it is funky. And I say try the pheasant because it actually has some spice. Beyond that, skip the rest of them yeah. completely. For two fifty um, a piece. Way too much money. Buy so, two slim jim. That's right. So <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.